Hey guys, welcome back to Andy's Dinosaur Reviews. So I have something really, really exciting here before me today. It is a box that was just sent my way from Marco Makes. I have absolutely no idea what is inside this box. He did not tell me. He just told me that he was sending me a gift and... I could not be more thankful for whatever it is inside. Again, that was just super nice of him, super cool. He's just one of the nicest guys ever. I absolutely love conversing with him and checking out, of course, all of the newest figures that he's making and just generally a really good guy. So something coming from him I know is going to be pretty darn cool. So I am really psyched about this. Cannot wait to open this up and see what he sent me. So let's go ahead, break this box open, and we'll see what's inside. So as we open this up, we actually have, whoa, I'm almost knocking the box over. We have a thing here that says that it is a gift for me from Marco and Sora. And we're going to go ahead and see what is inside here. Again, I'm so happy that he decided to send something over. It was just like totally out of the blue. I did not expect it at all. And it's just so exciting not knowing what's, oh, wow. Okay, straight away before I even actually go into this a little further, look at this. Man, is that beautiful. That is like the nicest looking Ceratosaurus that I may have ever seen. And that I love his paint scheme that he's given this as well. I actually may use that on a model here at some point because that is a really beautiful looking paint scheme. But that is one incredible drawing. Again, on top of being one of the nicest guys ever, Marco's potentially the most talented human being I've ever met. And I've told him this numerous times because the guy can literally do anything. No matter what it is, he can do anything. Just for instance, take a look at how quickly he picked up on ZBrush with his most recent Kingdom Collection busts, the Raptor busts. That was like a day's work for him. And he just pulled it out of nowhere, having no prior knowledge of ZBrush at all. He's just insanely impressive. And this drawing right here is a very good example of that, because that is just probably the nicest looking Ceratosaurus that I've ever seen in my entire life. So insanely awesome of him to send this over. Now I have more pieces of Marco Makes art to put up on my wall. Absolutely love that. And this stuff is falling out of the box. Pull this out of the way in just a second so I don't take out the camera with this because it's a little hard to get into it right there in that position. Oh man. Okay. This actually makes a whole lot of sense to me. Wow, it's actually one that's fully painted too. Oh man. And there's actually something else in here as well. No way. No way. He actually... Oh, man. Hold on. I cannot wait to bring this in. He actually sent me the Lyoplorodon and Ichthyosaurus, his walking with dinosaurs models that both him and his girlfriend have recently created, but... There's actually even more, because if we turn this around, there's the Dilophosaurus as well. Oh my god, I could not be more excited about this. I cannot even begin to stress how unbelievably excited I am about this. And on top of getting both of these, like, they actually come with the containers themselves that they go in, like the box art and everything. I don't have this from the raptors that I got from him a ways back that he was kind and sent me just as like a super awesome free gift. It didn't come with like the box art or anything so I was unable to actually get a hold of any of Marco's box art until I got his Rex. That box art was unbelievable but this is like my very first smaller sized rubber sores that come with the box themselves. I gotta break these out of here. I gotta take a look at them. These are like potentially the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. And I'm not even holding them in front of the screen. I'm just taking a look at them really quick here outside of the screen. But look at how awesome that is. That entire thing, the Dilophosaurus, the box art that comes with it is like the most unbelievably beautiful and nostalgic thing I think I've ever seen. It is so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. That Dilophosaurus looks fantastic straight away. I'm so psyched to see it, you know, fully painted and everything by Marco, which I really love having stuff that he creates that's fully done by him, fully finished like his Spinosaurus and his Raptors. I love having those in my collection, but it's easily one of the highlights of my collection right now is to have this fully boxed Dilophosaurus from Marco. And look at how beautiful the box art is here on the back. Man, to say Marco does the work of the Jurassic Gods would be putting it very, very mildly. This is exactly what us as Jurassic Park fans pretty much are aching to own, and Marco is just creating it all entirely by himself. Again, like I stated, Marco's probably the most talented guy in the world, and I would say that these are a pretty good example of that. 
cannot wait to get these actually up for review. I'm definitely going to review that Dilophosaurus, but again, he also sent the Liaplorodon and Ichthyosaurus, and the box art on this as well is picture perfect, but the models themselves, man, are those beautiful. The actual paint and sculpts are just off the charts, insanely, insanely gorgeous. Like, I could not ask for a more beautiful looking Ichthyosaurus and Liaplorodon at all, no matter what. Wow, that's just, I'm really enjoying taking a closer look at this because this is my first chance to actually look at this in person. And man, he is so good at this. Like, that Liaplorodon and the Ichthyosaurus, actually, which I believe this was actually sculpted by his girlfriend, not Marco himself. So it's really cool to actually have a two pack that, you know, one figure that each person has created, but they both look perfect to what they look like in walking with dinosaurs and then if we turn it around and take a look at the back we have the really really cool looking box art here in the back as well i love that the liaplorodon is right here front and center and you can see the ichthyosaurus back there kind of hiding out monsters of the deep up here and if you have seen the walking with dinosaurs series which i would like to think that most people that probably watch my channel have and if you haven't Make sure you check it out because it is absolutely awesome. But you'll obviously know why the Liaplorodon and Ichthyosaurus are put together in one set. But uh, this actually makes so much sense because I just recently had uh, noticed somebody posting on Facebook that Marco had posted these for sale. And I didn't even know he was doing it at the time. I had no idea that they were going up for sale and they are asking who was able to snag one. And when I saw it, I was like, ah, oh, no, I missed it. So I went instantly to... Uh, Marco and I had asked him if they actually did go up for sale and had I missed them and he said that he had one set aside for me so no worries and now this actually makes a lot of sense as to why because I have it right here to take a look at with you guys and enter into my collection so I cannot thank Marco enough and Sora for being so unbelievably awesome not only obviously creating these in the first place but for being just incredibly generous and sending these my way. I don't even honestly know what to say at this point. That's easily one of the nicest things ever, and I honestly cannot say thank you enough to both of them for, again, their kindness and their generosity to send these over for me to have here in my collection. But obviously, since they are now here in my collection, this incredibly awesome gift, these will be for sure coming up for review on the channel immediately. So make sure you keep checking back to the channel, of course, to see these reviews when they do go up, which again would be very, very soon. So again, one last huge thank you to Marco for both of these figures, as well as this beautiful Ceratosaurus art here. Easily one of the coolest things that I've received in the mail in a very, very long time. So thank you so much to both Marco and Sora for the incredibly awesome gifts. And make sure you check back for the reviews and make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.